Good morning folks, this is Bill from Little White Dory and we're down here in the, the grow room and I thought I'd give you a little quick show you what's going on down here. Um, I have maxed out, all right? I'm gonna flip this around so I can uh, so show you what I'm talking about. Okay, so how do I put this? I've got X number of shells that hold X number of trays and I have now reached X capacity. Um, right now the only space available would be some trays based down at the bottom over here where I could be heated. I have one more tray that's just, oh wait, no, I could stick it up in the corner over there. I didn't realize. So I'll move that and then I have space for four new starts down here, which I'm not going to be starting anytime soon. Um, as I move up, I've got all the different aged plants. This is one of my first tomato batch. Um, I just measured, they're about five inches tall. As I come over to this, this is my, my solitary grow rack, meaning no germinating or nothing too delicate here. <clears throat> and up here, these tomatoes are um, five inches, roughly 15 centimeters. And they're looking good. I'm happy with them. Uh, I don't have any mold issues, none that I can see. Um, each time I drop one of these trays out, it lowers the plant, so it gives me a little more space, but I just dropped them today. You can see this is, the plant was yesterday. I've dropped them down, but it's almost even. So this one's just growing a little bit slower. Um, and then as I come down, you can see the same thing. I'm looking at the amount of space between the top of the plants, oops, I'm trying to kiss that edge there, the light and the plant. So these are getting close, and I'll change these over to the shorter trays probably today. And I need those bigger trays. A little further down, here's another tray of tomatoes. That's probably a little bit smaller. It says the 14th. This is a tray, the San Marzano's, that I gave up on, but they're coming back. I guess they just got a slower start. Again, another pepper that we have to drop down a little. Maybe the same here and that one. We'll put them on the thinner trays. Some of the cooler um, temperature stuff. I've got some tomatoes down here that I'm trying to slow them up a little bit. And um, a tray of kale, some um, hybrid early girls. And down here I've got basil, lavender, and uh, my mom, dahlias. The dahlias are growing bigger, the <laughs> lavender's not. And I'm gonna have to figure out what I'm gonna do with that. They're two very different speeds, that was a mistake. These are parsley. I'm surprised that they're going as slow as they're going, but I'm okay with it. And cilantro. Um, some of these things may be moving outside into a, my first greenhouse that may not be heated, but it'll have daytime uh, comfy temperatures for now. But that's it, everything's full. All the spaces are, tra you know, all the tray space is full under light or under heat. And uh, that's it. We're uh, spending probably about, let's see, it's, I don't know what time it is. <laughs> I think it's probably about 9.30 or so, and I've been down here since about say, uh, six, six, seven o'clock, I'll say. And that's rotating the trays, checking to see if their the moisture's a little, a little right, filling the trays with water for the bottom water, flipping and rotating the trays on the bottom, draining out any excess water. <clears throat> I put a fan on. These little fans over here are just moving air. In fact, I'm going to turn them off now because I don't need them anymore. I, I don't need it moving all the time. And I also have a forced hot air heating system, so... I have this fan over here, and it's just pushing air away from the system over here, and I get air blowing down from the main vent up here. So it's not exactly the best circulation of air, but it hasn't had, I haven't had a problem yet. And this fan is new, I haven't bothered with the fan before. So with this being here, just keeping air moving, and then down underneath here is where the return is. So, you know, it's not stagnant air, and in addition to that, I also have, uh, safe, safe from here, just to zoom in, I have a vent that uh, I can exhaust air out over here. So with that all said, five and a half minutes, four and a half minutes, excuse me, that you can't have back. And it uh, looks like we're getting the, the legginess for the tomatoes under control. Alrighty, folks, have a good day. Bye-bye.